I don't even know how to start explaining what's happening here, so I'm just going to start playing it because just to see, there's no way to describe the, the nonsense here. Okay, so. Okay, so actually, let me give you some context. Do you know Hazrat Zahra or Hazrat Fatima? That's the daughter of Prophet Muhammad, right? Yeah. yeah. The daughter of Prophet Muhammad married Ali. Among Shia Muslims, the most revered woman in the world is her, you know, Hazrat Zahra, right? So she is kind of worshipped like a goddess, even though they would not say that. But Fatima or Zahra among Shias is worshipped like a goddess. There's nobody, no woman higher. So she's revered very much. So now he, he is describing her marriage ceremony. Okay. What happened during her wedding. <laughs> to Ali. Right? So let's see what happened. Yeah, to Ali, yes. Okay, okay. okay. All right. So in the night of her wedding, right? So God ordered the tree of Toba. I don't know what that kind of what kind of tree is that, but there's apparently a kind of tree that God commanded that tree. So in the honor of this marriage. Like what do I, what do people do in weddings? They they throw nogl in the air, so it's kind of a sweet. So they like I, I don't know if they do, do that anywhere else. Rice yeah? in in the United States often rice oh. is kind of what rice. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I so, know it's weird. I mean, uncooked though, yeah, cooked weird. rice would be weirder. But anyway, yeah. Well, in other places they do these white colored sweets. Yeah. Yeah, that right, sense. that you yeah. throw. It's kind of like rice, but bigger, and you yeah. can eat it, and it's sweet. Okay, so they throw that in the air, right? To sweeten up. So, yeah, yeah, that's actually kind of nicer. But yeah. yeah. So that's what happens in weddings. Like they throw these things at people's heads in weddings. So he said, like back then, apparently they said the same kind of traditions. He's claiming. Okay? So like during that wedding. Um, they mixed nuts and sweets together and they threw it. So they, yeah, the mix of sweets and uh, nuts. So they so during the wedding, they were uh, they had handful of this and they were you know throwing it at people. And the people would catch it and they would eat it. And like that would that's what was happening on earth so that was what's happening on earth but in heavens there was also some something happening but what happened to the what? tree i don't know what did I he command he, the tree. The tree. he hasn't gotten back to that he mentioned that allah I've, commanded the tree but then yeah, now he's I don't talking know if he's about good. nuts and sweets at the wedding okay i no, don't I just, know if he forgot that story or if he's going to get back to the tree okay, we'll see okay. that yeah okay. You know, you know, he says, like, obvious, obviously, angels don't eat food, obviously, right? So angels, oh, like, no. it's up there in yeah. heavens, obviously, angels yeah. don't eat anything. Oh, okay, we're back to the tree. He says, like, God ordered to the tree, okay? Okay, okay. Huh? He says like, wait a minute, what the hell? I, <laughs> oh, so he says like, from the fruits that are like modeled like jewelry, from the fr from fruits that are kind of like jewelry, yeah, well, yeah. Like when they look like. Uh, pearls or diamonds or other gems, like fruits that are modeled like that. Okay, I don't know. I, I'm okay. just translating. Don't look at okay. me. <laughs> so throw that upon the angels. Okay. So so. No, okay. Wait. <laughs> okay. So hang on. So God commanded yeah. a tree to make fruits for the angels. Is that what he's saying? I don't know. I don't know if he makes understand. it or he just throws it. <laughs> I, think I, he's don't just, I think the bra I think the tree is throwing it. I don't know it's if it's throwing it, it at the. It's throwing it at the angel. angel. I don't understand this. Yeah. Okay, I, yeah. maybe he'll okay. explain. 
during the wedding. So apparently the wed- the angels in heaven were also celebrating this marriage and God wanted to treat the angels. So this is what the tree but was angels doing. angels don't yeah. eat, obviously. So why would the tree so, throw fruit at the... I don't understand. Okay. Just, I don't know. He we'll see. We'll see. Yeah. Maybe that's why the fruits had to look like jewelry because they're not oh, going to the, eat it. So it has to the look an- They're going to wear it like jewelry. I, Wait, do I angels don't know what they're going to do with it. Do angels wear? I don't know. Jewelry? It's I don't obvious know. Yes, that they I don't, don't eat food, but do they wear jewelry? Right. That's. I don't know, and I don't, I don't know. know if they don't. They have fruits in heaven because I heard I they do. They, but I'm pretty also. sure they eat in heaven. I thought there's been description of that, but I, I couldn't. No, be wrong yeah, we have fruits. We have been described that they have like fruit trees for the, you, in, in heaven. Don't yeah, but, isn't yeah. isn't the Islamic understanding that like you'll you'll be able to drink a bunch of wine all all day, but you yeah, won't but get that's drunk? for us, not the angels. That's for oh, us. Okay. Angels don't yeah, eat anything. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. بدو از این حرف فاس از اون قسمش بیا پاچ به سر ملائکه ملائکه ریختن مثل بچه‌هایی که تو عروسی می‌ریزن این پولی چیزی اوکی okay, so the angels in response they just jumped into little children in during a wedding where they go and when you throw money and stuff they, the children in the wedding they go try to collect the money that they throw in weddings so it says these angels like little children they came quickly بکنن جمع بکنن ملائکه ریختن و این دور رو یاقوت و چی و چی که ریخته بود اینا رو جمع کردن Okay, so he said, like, they collected these gems and these diamonds and pearls and gems. So I don't know why he's now referring to them the as fruit, gems and jewelry. The fruit from a tree I, that looks like jewelry and gems. Yeah, but now he's okay. just referring to them as gems. I don't know if, they, if they're actually fruits or gems. I think they, I, I, it's not very clear. But yeah. He's like, there's a saying that these angels... So the saying is that each one of these angels that collected these for, during the wedding of Fatima and Ali, right? Or Zahra and Ali, the angels that managed to collect more of these, they are they will continuously brag about the fact that they collected more of it from now to the day of judgment. <laughs> Like from the t- from now to the end of times, they will constantly brag about the fact that they have collected more of these items. Hey, uh, right. hey, Bill, so, so. how many of those uh, weird <laughs> fruit diamonds did you pick up? You know, thousands of years ago. Oh, just three. Oh, <laughs> I've got six. <laughs> Sucks to right, be you. Exactly. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me! You're telling right, me in right. heaven. You're telling me in heaven, people are like hey. jealous and bragging about stuff. Like that's ridiculous. That's just so crazy. Right. That's just so stupid. Well, I mean, let me see if he has something more to say and then I'll explain sure. what's happening. Man, here. <laughs> oh, yeah. So they, actually, you were making fun of him with the example, but he's actually giving that example. No, he is. He like, no, he yeah, is. Like, yeah. He's like, so one angel will say that during the Fatima's wedding, You had you collected 10, but I collected 12. So the numbers That's were different. That's ridiculous, Armin. But he's actually giving That's you the crazy. example. Yeah. You know, you know <laughs> folks, the reason that I, I use that example is because I thought it was absurd. I thought it was stupid right. and ridiculous <laughs> right. and thought no no serious person would use <laughs> right. this as an example. As and, a, and, no. Wow. And he used it as an example. Yeah, sometimes, yeah, yeah. sometimes. <laughs> Sometimes it's not as good to be proven right, y'all. Like it's just, you know, <laughs> yeah. like this yeah. is this, yeah, yeah. anyway. Okay. Yeah. Oh, the other one would say I, I collected 15. 15. One one of them would be so sorry that he only managed to collect eight. one of them would be so sorry that he only managed to collect eight. And until the day of judgment to the end of times they will constantly there would be an honor to the for honor to them for until the day of judgment that they managed to collect more as in nisar ke istilahan in chizi ke pakhsh mikonan o nisar migan arabi ini ke dar un shab pakhsh shode man masalan 4 ta dun bishtar bardashtam behesh iftikhar manam budam iftikhar mikardam arda like if they collected four more than others they would they would see that as a sort of pride and honor that they managed to collect four and he's also confirming that obviously he, if he himself this mullah himself if i was like them i would have also been proud of that i would have also found honor in that if i collected more this, is, this is really armin i i don't want to sound yeah. i don't want to sound insensitive right to other 
mm. you know, culture Be careful now. or tradition. Be I don't want to, I don't want yeah. to cultural sensitivity here. Yeah. I'm, I'm trying, I'm trying my best, you know, to yeah. be open-minded, you know, to, to, no. to understand other people from where they're coming from. This is stupid. Right. This is dumb. No, this is, this I, is just I really, bigotry you talking. That's what it, it must not, be. <laughs> it must be yeah. because there's no <laughs> other, there's no other good explanation, you know, for right. me just being right. like, wait, you're telling well, me you that in a, try to be more accepting of but, other people. But Elliot. you're telling me that in a perfect existence, Armin. In a perfect right. existence, some freaking tree made some fruit once that perfect beings, angels, are like bragging well, about each other. I, I guess they're not perfect, but like you get yeah. what I'm saying. Like they're 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 still I like mean, if you collected only eight, of course you're not perfect. <laughs> <laughs> should, should he even really be an angel anymore like come on he didn't even get like whatever dude god that was right, so good right. oh my god right, right, okay right. So, all right yeah. all right i don't like that. okay so do you understand the purpose of a story like this I, because I, there I is guess... something to hit here yeah. yeah let me let me see because i i i Again, again, folks, I think this is kind of dumb, but I, I think I understand what he's getting at, which is basically what he's saying is that this wedding was so it was so important in the heavens like this. This confirms how big of a deal, you know, right. Ali was right like that's be, because of look, Fatima look, was Fatima, the okay, daughter okay. of Mama. Yeah, OK, yeah. so so yeah. so right. It's like it's like look how important they are because of yes, this event, yes. because of these things, right? I mean, is that, that yes. that's what he's getting at, right? So here's the thing. It's a po like, you, you, we see the ridiculousness of it as a flaw. They see it as the point mm -hmm. because they mm -hmm. want to show how much, basically, right. these stories yeah. are meant to show how big of a deal Ali and Fatima are. We have stories like this for Hussein as well. And they are so crazy because how important it seems to you that they're crazy but you don't understand this is Fatima is such an important person that of course as an angel just like a small token of her wedding would be a badge of honor for you of course it just feels Armin it just feels shirky <laughs> It, oh, just yeah. really, <laughs> it just really, it just feels like you know me coming from a Christian background, right? Like this concept of like a Trinity thing, like isn't that wild? So it's like, how can you worship God and Jesus? And it's like, ah, we're Christians, we got it all figured out. But this just feels, it, it feels. Do Sunnis, do Sunnis have somebody oh, that no, they, they, they? Well, I know, I know, I know they hate this. But do they yeah, have yeah. somebody that they like feel this special about? Do they have like? Well, actually, Sunnis have a hadith or not a hadith, a saying by Abu Bakr, the first Khalifa, mm -hmm. that kind of shows the opposite. So mm -hmm. when so Abu Bakr is for Sunni is is the first Khalifa, mm -hmm. right? So. This is what Sonny's brag about, especially when they compare want to compare themselves to uh, Shias. So when Muhammad died, and people were very upset, they were all crying, and they couldn't believe that Muhammad could even die. Right? When I, I mean, everybody who couldn't get over the fact that Muhammad is dead, Abu Bakr comes to the people, comes to Muslims, and he said something. I'm not not exactly this, but this basically gave this message. Right? He said. To all of you who were worshiping Muhammad, Muhammad is dead. Wow. But to the rest of you who mm -hmm. worship Allah, mm -hmm. we have we have to now work for keeping Islam alive. Like we have to work wow. on Islam. Right? Yeah, so that's pretty basically, wow. Yeah. Yes. So he was like basically like, we need to focus on. And no, no, I'm not. I know this is not exactly his saying, but yeah. I remember this. This was Pretty the message. Statement. Like, yes, yes. Focus on focus so, on what you're supposed to be focused on. 
like Muhammad focus on the religion all, like, Muhammad yeah. yeah yeah Muhammad was just a messenger uh -huh, uh -huh. Islam is still Muhammad is dead wow. Islam is still alive wow that was basically the message Islam is Islam is forever Muhammad wow. was temporary Islam is forever basically I don't so, know. You can, yeah. I kind of like the story where my guy is is like has jewels in heaven that angels brag. About. Right. Yeah. You like know what? That is more entertaining. It's more I mean, fun. If, if if your religion is not entertaining you, then why even be religious, right? <laughs> like, what's the it's, point? It's all ridiculous right. nonsense anyway. You might as well pick the right. one that's the most enjoyable. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Perfect. Yes. Okay. You convinced me back to Shiism. I was almost becoming a Sunni. I, I was welcome, just folks. almost becoming, I was convincing myself to be a Sunni, but you're right. You're right. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yeah. yeah. Okay. It's, it's, okay. That so. was great. That was great. <laughs> if I, if I saw fucking preachers saying shit like that, if I saw a Christian preacher saying shit like that, Arben, I'd have fucking left Christianity so much longer. <laughs> so much ago. earlier. Like, oh my god! Oh my god! Right. That's so. Right. That's just so silly. The thought uh -huh. of that, like, oh my god! <laughs> like in in, okay. it's only ever been like, oh, and the angels were all like excited in heaven and they played trumpets or shit. Like I've heard that mm -hmm. stuff about some people, but I've never heard like, oh yeah, they collected like trinkets, you know. 